Will the old block five be convicted of LBG Doug murder? Will Muwap be convicted? See thing now. Uh, people ask me that. They want to know truth. Give us your opinion. No bagging down. Tell us, cold cut. What is it? Um, I still think it's a little too early to kind of give you an answer to that, especially with us finding out that this trial is going to be next year in August. I think that's enough time for shit to still come out, this case updating as it comes. Uh, I'm not going to lie, though, you know, when it comes to, like, FBG Duck side, they got, like, you know, the feds on their side. That's, like, the best people to have when it's a case. You know, his mother, his side, his family want justice for FBG Duck. They not looking at Duck as just somebody who's going to lose his life and it is what the fuck it is. They want justice for that young man, you know. They got love for that young man, and I think that's the right thing from a family standpoint. You can't be mixing mom and family, cousin, uncle, aunties, and sisters in that street shit. You know, they want justice for their loved one. Uh, I do think with the feds having a strong conviction rate, they have things to kind of make you stay in jail for a long ass time. The fact that it's not a lot of information came out, the case going to be next year, it makes it feel like they still add on to this case. Um, at the same token, I haven't said in plenty of blogs. Um, the information we didn't got so far is kind of circumstantial, a license plate reader. Uh, videotapes and things like that. We haven't seen the tapes to know if it shows faces and things like that. But I'm not going to lie. When the feds are in, them going to be hard cases to kind of like defeat. Uh, the police is going to portray these guys as the worst type of guys in the world. That's why they put the old black gang on them, the Rico cases and shit like that. You know, they're going to go all the way back from Chief Keith. Remember, they kind of banned them from the rack. They're going to go back to Lil Dirk. They're going to go back to all the murders that might have occurred from people who lived in old block or rumored to be in old block. Internet videos, rap lyrics, King Von Depp. You know, it's a lot of things that happened. You know, in that area that I think they're going to use to kind of portray these guys as killers, gunmen. Rap lyrics will be used in this. We all know that. Uh, I think a lot of guys going to become very hot when this case drops. Not hot on some rap shit, but name very hot as far as on the police market. I think it's going to be a, a lot of shit going to happen. I wouldn't be surprised if you start seeing, you know, a bigger Rico indictment shit. This could just be the beginning. It just feels like. Hopefully not. Not trying to put no salt on nobody. But when you look at this shit, I think this case, you know, the feds got to look into this case to convict them. I think the more they look into this case, they're going to hear a lot of names that was involved in these coaches. I just think, you know, taking the chance and duck losing his life downtown, opening up the gates that I think going to be hard to close that door. You know, me personally, I think, you know, it's going to be hard, you know. I think this is going to be the beginning of them trying to clean up o, the O Block. Not saying it needs to be cleaned up, but from the public perception. Uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm going to keep you updated on this, but I'm not going to lie, you know. Feds are looking into this. Just imagine all the questions that was asked in those interrogation rooms. But it looked like those brothers got their mouth closed. They're not talking. And normally when you don't talk, it'd be kind of a little hard to convict, but with the feds, this might be a little different, you know. So right now, I'm leaning towards I don't really know, you know. I think we got a whole nother year for information to come out. I think the reason, I think the feds going to portray them a certain way. But for me to come up with a conclusion, I got to know the full reason. They say a rap battle, a rap beef turned real life, you know. Uh, to take a chance to go downtown and. You know, I just think these are real strong chances, allegedly. So, you know, maybe they can paint a better picture that we can see. But as the picture I see right now, this is crazy, you know. But like I tell you, subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm going to keep you updated. But when people want my opinion on this, I'm not 100% sure exactly what's going to happen. But, you know, it's a possibility that we never see these guys again. And it's a possibility that these guys can come home. It's a possibility these guys can get a deal and come home soon. So, who knows? Uh, the feds is a little tight lip on this, you know? This is one case that's kind of high profile that nobody really knows about. Normally, when the case is this quiet, it wasn't quiet when they came down and started indicting, going in careers and arresting people. But the information on this case has been sealed, quiet, which means 
I think this case is bigger than what we think it is. I think it's going to be more things coming out. You know, it's a possibility of more arrests. Maybe not, but I just think this case, I don't think we got all the information in this case, clearly, for it to be another year. But uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Bam.